Understanding your GRE score report. Hello, dear learners. Today, we are delving deep into the realm of the GRE and, specifically, the magic behind its score report. If you've ever wondered about how your score is determined and what it means, you're in the right place. Let's demystify this process together. The GRE, or Graduate Record Examinations, is split into different sections, each of which has its own scoring mechanism. The main scores you'll see are Verbal Reasoning, scored on a scale of 130 to 170, in one-point increments. Quantitative Reasoning, also scored on a scale of 130 to 170, in one-point increments. Analytical Writing, this is scored differently, ranging from 0 to 6, in half-point increments. The GRE is unique because it employs adaptive testing. This means that the difficulty of the questions you face changes based on your performance. If you answer correctly, the questions get tougher. Answer incorrectly, and they might become a bit easier. But here's the interesting part. Your final score is not just about the number of correct answers. It's also about the difficulty of the questions you answered. This adaptive nature ensures a more accurate representation of your skills. Besides the main scores mentioned earlier, your score report will also contain Total score The sum of your verbal and quantitative scores this will range from 260 to 340. Percentile rank. This tells you the percentage of test takers you scored better than. For example, a 90th percentile rank means you scored higher than 90% of the test takers. It's essential to understand that while the scores provide an objective measure, different graduate programs prioritize scores differently. Some might place more emphasis on quantitative scores, while others might focus on verbal scores or analytical writing. It's always a good idea to research your desired schools and see what scores they value the most. That wraps up our exploration of the GRE score report. Remember, while scores are important, they are just one facet of your application. Keep practicing, keep learning, and remember that understanding the scoring can give you an edge in your preparation. Best of luck, and we hope this video has been illuminating.